like to start off today's show with a little bit of sad news. Um, if you haven't already heard, Titans have been eliminated from the playoffs. Um, it's not a big deal. Um, Titans are used to heartbreak. Um, it's just a game. It's a game kids play in the backyard. It's not worth getting upset over. Just picture a depressed onion cutting itself. Anyway, if you missed the game, here's a live look at Joe Burrow eliminating the Titans from the playoffs. Yeah. In addition to the Titans, the Packers were also eliminated from the playoffs. So, uh, Aaron Rodgers, you playing next week? You know, I know there's possible players who could uh, return this week. I don't know what their status is going to be, but uh, that's exciting for sure. No, seriously, don't be vague. Like, you know you're not playing next week, right? No, I, I understand the gist of the question, and I don't th – there wouldn't be any doubt. Um, you know, it, it's similar to the take on practicing versus not practicing. You obviously love to practice, but – uh, you have to adjust uh, your preparation in order to, to perform on the field. Aaron, Aaron, I just need you to answer the question. You know you're not playing next week, right? Um, it's similar. I mean, the week is the week of preparation. And uh, obviously the bye uh, is helpful. The Buccaneers were also eliminated. Um, but you know who was not eliminated? Antonio Brown. So, genius? I think so. Um, I'm trying to bring a little bit of investigative journalism to my show every week so I can give you live accurate reporting as well as a mountain of comedy. Um, so I did a little digging. Players no longer need to seek permission to transfer. They can now enter something called the transfer portal, allowing contact with other schools. Antonio Brown, that's Antonio Brown without his uniform, we are told without his jersey and running out of the field. Turns out that Antonio Brown thought the transfer portal applied to the NFL, not college football. So, I could see the misunderstanding. We bet. We bet. Turning to MMA for a minute, uh, Francis Ngannou retained his heavyweight title against Cyril Gain. I mean, does that count for any the kick from Ngannou allows him to take him back with two? Yes. And it turns out... Three weeks ago, I hurt my uh, my knee, tore my MCL completely, I hurt my ACL and all those stuff. You know, man, wanted to call out this fight, but couldn't see, couldn't see myself uh, retreat from this fight. So... Will Fuller. Has Will Fuller returned to the building today? Uh, uh, we're still running some tests. He's in a lot of pain yesterday. Still in a you know good good deal of pain today. But um, you know, I think you know we'll, we'll call him day to day right now. Um, Can't wait for that off season content where everybody argues about soup and sandwiches and watches other sports like uh, how, what what are those other sports baseball. Baseball and basketball, yeah. In football, the object is for the quarterback, otherwise known as the field general, to be on target with his aerial assault, riddling the defense by hitting his receivers with deadly accuracy, in spite of the blitz, even if he has to use the shotgun. With short bullet passes and long bombs, he marches his troops into enemy territory, balancing this aerial assault with a sustained ground attack which punches holes in the forward wall of the enemy's defensive line. In baseball, the object is to go home. And to be safe. I hope I'll be safe at home. Safe at home. Also can't wait for all these draft profiles to be released for these college football players. Can't wait to read who the next Tyree Kill is. Will John Ross be the next Tyree Kill? This is Tyree Kill. That's who this is. This is the dimension he's going to have. There's only one Tyree Kill. Well, he's going to play a lot like Tyree Kill. So I guess the end of the season is a time for all of us to get reflective, not just the NFL players. And 
So here's a compilation of the best things that I've done on this show so far. And now here's some of the absolute worst. Yeah. Hey, Jesus here. Listen, stop praying to me for your fantasy football teams. I play too. And do you want to know what helps me win? Preparation, not prayer. This cookie represents Michael Thomas. Uh. Mm -hmm. <laughs>